How to wire a one-gang junction box for a dual single pole switch controlling two electrical outlets. One-gang junction box ready for connection. If necessary, label the cables. Sketch of a junction box spliced for connecting a dual single pole switch controlling two light outlets. Cable to the first controlled electrical outlet, light or receptacle. Cable to the second controlled electrical outlet, light or receptacle. Cable from the power source. Cable to another electrical outlet. Remove the cable sheath. Gather all ground, bare, wires together. Wrap the shorter wires around the longest one, and trim the shorter wires to no less than 6 inches long. Route the longest of the ground wires, bare, through the hole in the green wire nut and secure the wrapped wires with this wire nut. Insert the connection into the junction box, leaving the pigtail wire outside the box. Group all neutral, white, wires together, trim them to no shorter than 6 inches, and strip the ends of the wires about 1 half inch. Using pliers and a wire nut, splice all white wires together. Insert spliced wires into the junction box. Group hot, black, wires from the cable from the power source and the cable to the other electrical outlet, trim them to no shorter than 6 inches, and strip the ends of the wires about 1 half inch. Take a piece of black wire of the same gauge to make a pigtail, strip about one half inch of insulation from the end of this wire end. Using pliers and a wire nut, connect it to the hot, black wires from the junction box that have already been trimmed and their ends stripped.
Insert the spliced wires into the junction box, leaving the pigtail wire outside the box. Group the pigtail wires and all remaining hot, black, wires together and trim them to no shorter than 6 inches. Insert trimmed wires into the junction box. If this video is helpful please subscribe. Comments are welcome.